Tennis elbow can drag on for months and sometimes even years. And many people try physical therapy only to find that the pain keeps coming back. But what if there's a treatment that actually repairs and heals the tendon instead of just managing symptoms? Hey everyone, Dr. Jeff Pang here. I'm a sports medicine doctor currently practicing in the San Francisco Bay Area, and I've helped thousands of patients navigate orthobiologics and regenerative medicine treatments like platelet-rich plasma. A brand new randomized control trial followed over 200 patients suffering from tennis elbow for two years and compared popular treatments like physical therapy, platelet-rich plasma injections, prolotherapy, and extracorporeal shockwave therapy. Physical therapy involved daily stretching and eccentric wrist strengthening exercises. PRP consisted of a single ultrasound guided injection of concentrated platelets into the diseased tendon. They used a 30cc blood draw for around 5 billion platelets. Prolotherapy used dextrose injections to trigger a healing response, and shockwave therapy delivered pulses of mechanical energy to the tendon. And the results were remarkable. At the 24-month mark, all groups improved, but PRP and prolotherapy stood out. Patients who received PRP had an average improvement of 31 points on the DASH score compared with just 19 points in the physical therapy group. And for context, a 10-point change is considered clinically meaningful. Patient satisfaction followed the same pattern. PRP patients rated their outcomes 4.6 out of 5, while physical therapy averaged only 3. Prolotherapy also outperformed physical therapy, though not quite to the same degree as PRP. Shockwave therapy, on the other hand, did not show any advantage over exercise. So why does PRP stand so far above the rest of the treatments? And the answer lies in how it works. Platelet-rich plasma delivers a concentrated dose of your body's own growth factors directly into the damaged tendon. And these growth factors signal your tendon cells to produce new collagen, restore blood supply, and remodel tissue that's been stuck in a chronic degenerative state. So instead of just training the muscles around the elbow, PRP provides the exact biological ingredients that your tendon needs to actually repair itself. And this explains why the study showed such a dramatic difference. It wasn't just a little more improvement, it was nearly double the functional gains of physical therapy and significantly higher patient satisfaction. PRP is addressing the underlying problem, a tendon that has failed to heal on its own. Now, in my clinical practice, I usually recommend starting with a structured exercise program for at least four to six weeks. And the reality is that most people with tennis elbow will see significant improvement once they begin consistent rehab. But if symptoms persist, or if they're severe from the start, I take a more aggressive approach and often recommend PRP as the next step. Tennis elbow is notorious for lingering and dragging on, and that's exactly why PRP can be so valuable. By addressing the root cause and stimulating true tendon healing, PRP offers a powerful option to restore function and help patients regain their quality of life. So if you're interested in learning more about PRP injections, check out this next video where I give you a deep dive into what PRP actually is, what you can expect during and after the procedure, and most importantly, how to maximize your recovery so you get the best possible results.